morning students now we are going to start a new chapter that is chapter number 13 motion and time first see this activity draw a straight line on the ground with a chalk and ask one of your friend to stand a meter or two away from it that means your friend should stand 1 meter or 2 meter away from it and then let them roll a ball gently along the ground in a perpendicular direction to the line and note the time in a straight way the ball is rolled down and you have to note its time how much time it takes to cover up the distance and how much distance it is taken let them push the ball in a curved path now path will be changed first was rectilinear that means a straight line and then second curved path zigzag way and see the time taken and the distance covered by the ball so what you have to observe the time taken in rectilinear path and in curvilinear path both so the object changes with respect to time and this is known as motion various types of motion are there rectilinear circular periodic oscillatory motion which you have read in class 6 now in this chapter again we have to read in detail we have to determine whether an object is moving slow or fast and how do we measure the time also so two types of motion are there slow and fast motion if the object takes more time to cover up a given distance then it is known as slow motion and if the distance is covered in less time then it is fast motion see here it can be understand by the given example a group of three friends ashu atul and rajan go to the same school but by different modes of transport ashu travels distance of 2 km in 20 minutes atul cover this distance that means 2 km in 15 minute and rajan sorry sorry it is atul who cover the distance of 3 km in 15 minute and rajan covers a distance of 5 km in 15 minute then calculate the speed or compare this motion so what we need we need to find out the distance traveled by each one of them in the same time interval that means in one minute how much distance is covered by them so first in 20 minutes ashu covers 2 km so in one minute find out 2 km divided by 20 it is 0.1 km by atul 3 km is covered by covered in 15 minutes so it is 0.2 km and by rajan it is 5 km covered by 15 minutes covered in 15 minutes so it is 0.3 km so you can see here ashu covers 2 km and in 1 minute he 
covers 0.1 kilometer atul covers 0.2 kilometer and rajan covers 0.3 kilometer so what we find that we find that the distance covered by rajan is distance travels fastest by rajan that is a distance of 0.3 km per minute while asu travels slowest covering a distance of 0.1 km per minute so which one is faster and which one is slower now you can say very clearly rajan is fastest and asu is slowest 